Good morning, this is Raymond with Realtors Resource. Today is Wednesday, August 23rd. Uh, I'm at 6404 Northeast Alberta Street in Portland. This will be the uh, second of uh, the two sewer inspection videos. First one was done through the uh, three inch cast iron main roof vent. Uh, we were unsuccessful. Uh, it appears at the bottom of the uh, bottom of the cast iron uh, sewer inside the house at the bottom of the uh, vent. Um, is eroded away and is not allowing anything through, not even my camera, and it does not appear to be uh, water is getting through either. Uh, we did find this 3 inch ABS cleanout, and that's located off the front of the house. So I'm in the horizontal. I'm going to be heading out towards the street. Um, even though we can't run water, uh, I can visually see that my camera is pointed in the right direction. So we're going to evaluate the line from this, uh, this clean out located off the front right corner of the house uh, all the way to the main. We're currently in 4 inch ABS so this pipe material is not original to the house. During our first evaluation going through the roof vent uh, we did get eyes on the uh, roof vent as well as uh, some secondary piping in the utility closet and we did see water pouring through that joint. So there's some serious plumbing issues that need to be addressed inside the house. Leaking, uh, leaking secondary drain line as well as the compromised main roof stack at the bottom of the uh, stack where it joins the sewer. As those issues are located inside the building envelope, they will need to be addressed by a licensed plumber. But coming through the ABS section of this branch of the sewer, not seeing any damage to the system as of yet. And if we were able to run water, I would imagine that we would see good slope and fall to this particular part of the sewer. Let me taking a bend down. And we're going to bottom out here. Ninety-two feet. We're going to transition to four-inch PVC Okay, here at 96 feet, we reach the city sanitary sewer main. See that? We got water coming through there still. Mm -hmm. I wonder if there's a toilet around there. So what it is, it's backed up inside the house and it's some of it um, coming yeah. through and yep. it's slowly coming through. Okay, here at uh, here at the transition to the 4 inch PVC 3034, we do have a slight offset in the flow path of the pipe. <coughs> you can see the, uh, bo uh, the uh, uh, lip of the PVC 3034 pipe. This does have the potential to um, trap paper and solids. This is going to be located out in the street, so this will be the responsibility of the City of Portland to repair. So I'm just going to retract the camera here. Uh, the access point that I went through appears to be a two-way clean-out. So I'm going to see if I can go upstream and get the camera into the house maybe get a better look at the uh, the compromise that I believe is at the bottom of that main vent stack in the um, cast iron sewer inside the house.
Okay, so far I have not seen any damage to this particular section of the ABS sewer. So now I'm going to attempt to get my camera to go upstream. So I positioned my camera to go upstream. Now we're turning into the house. Here's our cast. Yeah, but it all the bugs. doesn't matter right there. Yeah. Okay, so this is the uh, cast iron transition. As you can see, we do have water trickling out of this pipe. Currently, no water is running inside the house. So on our first inspection through the roof vent we did run water through the tub as well as the kitchen sink so I'll flush the toilet in the back bathroom a couple of times and I'm just not able to make it up I'm just not able to make it up past this separation or this offset here um, but we should not have any water coming through this sewer so this is the residual of everything that we ran during the first inspection so this does support my original uh, findings that uh, there is a compromise to the three inch cast iron sewer uh, quite possibly either before or where it meets the uh, 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 main roof vent. So still going to recommend that a licensed plumber evaluate the uh, cast iron main stack and cast iron sewer inside the building envelope. Can you locate that? It's inside the house. Oh it is? Yeah. Well, let me make sure. I'm just curious. I'm going to go ahead and locate this. How far are we from that stack? You know that. What? It should be much, for sure. I would hope not. You know, because we go down and then we turn in.
So I was able to locate exactly where that transition is. It's just outside the building envelope on the right, back right side of the house, roughly one foot ten inches deep. Okay, and we're back out of the system. Okay, to summarize, uh, uh, sanitary sewer inside the building envelope uh, where the uh, main stack hits the um, main cast iron sewer servicing the house. Uh, that needs to be repaired. Um, as I suspect that it has it, it has become eroded and uh, is not allowing water to uh, flow through the system. Um, other secondary uh, plumbing inside the crawl space was observed to be leaking. So that'll need to be addressed as well. Uh, the sanitary sewer from the cast iron transition all the way to the uh, to the sanit city sanitary sewer main appears to be functioning properly. That is all ABS. Uh, so it looks like just the, uh, the work inside the building envelope will need to be done in order to bring the sewer back into a functional, uh, a functional state. Uh, again, please keep in mind this is video two of two. Uh, this will complete sanitary sewer inspection for 6404 Northeast Alberta Street in Portland. Thank you.